Hey there guys, it's John here, and it's finally time I do a Q&A video. Um, I've only been putting this off for three weeks now. Anyway, I have tons of great questions that you guys left. I have, There's about 60-something pages worth of uh, questions, and I think it's time that we just we jump in and we get wet. So let's just start it off here. Do you have Ultra Violent on Blu-ray? If so, what did you think? Ultra Violent, I seen about 10 minutes of it, and I got sick to my stomach. Last time you had... Okay. What's your favorite horror film? I like Nightmare on Elm Street. Uh, hey, Nancy! Yeah, okay. Um, it's late. Okay? Okay? The impressions aren't going to be any better than that. What is your favorite food? Um, favorite food is... I like ribs, steak, um, and I like rice. I don't know. That's weird, right? And color, my favorite color is, I'm going to go with a blue and TV show. Right now it's going to be Breaking Bad. Um, but uh, do you ever get noticed on the street? No. Um, I'm, I'm just a little guy on YouTube. So um, uh, how many Blu-rays and how many DVDs do you own? Uh, to be honest with you, I, I don't really count them. Um, I'm going to guess 600 maybe. Uh, and first cinema experience. I don't remember the first time I went to the movie theater, but I remember going to Jurassic Park when I was little and crying, and then my they took me out, and then we went home, and then my dad took me back two days later to see it. Um, yeah, lamb or pork? Mm, I never ate lamb. Uh, white bread or brown bread? By brown bread, do you mean wheat bread? I, I like wheat bread. I don't know why. I'm starting to eat tuna. I'm starting to eat, yeah, tuna sandwiches. Fucking gross, right? I don't know why, but I'm eating them. Um... Do you own any Red Letter Media DVDs? No, I don't own any of... That's the guy who did the 90-minute Star Wars review. I don't own any of their DVDs, but I do watch all their uh, reviews. Um, okay. You said that The Warriors is one of your favorite movies of all time, yet, to my knowledge, you don't own the DVD or Blu-ray. I own the, the DVD. It's setting over there. I don't own the Blu-ray. I want to, but I just... You gotta... I don't know why. I just can't get it up to buy it. Um, all right. What's your religion? Um, you know, I'm, I don't go to church. Um, I'm just a guy who believes in doing what's right and what makes you happy. How tall are you? Six foot. Um, what's your favorite Arnie Sly, Willis, Van Damme, Seagal, Mel Gibson, and Clint Eastwood films? I would be here for 14 hours if I had to answer all that. Arnie, we're going to go with T2. Willis, we're going to go with Die Hard with a Vengeance. Sylvester Stallone, we're going to go with Over the Top. Hey, I know, I know, maybe Rocky. Um, Van Damme. Bloodsport, Seagal, um, you know, who gives a shit about that guy? Mel Gibson? Ooh, Mel Gibson, that's a hard one. I like him in the movie The Patriot, for some odd reason. And Clint Eastwood, uh, Gran Torino. Um, have you ever seen the show Heroes? No, I haven't seen the show Heroes. I've seen parts. Um, if you could watch one last movie before you died, what would it be? Uh, over the top. Um... Uh, you asked me a whole bunch of other questions here, and uh, that's too much to read. Um, so my brain... Uh, okay, I'll, re I'll read one of them. Now that the DC Avengers would be everyone from the Avengers along with pretty much everyone, Spider-Man, X-Men, Fantastic Four, again, Christian Bell as Batman... Okay, wasn't a question. Um, have you ever danced with the evil... Oh, have you ever danced with the devil on a pale moon night? No, but I'm sure I will dance with the devil one day, and he, he will proceed to shove pineapples in my rectum for all the sins I've committed. What's your favorite sci-fi horror film? Uh, we'll, go with, we'll go with Aliens. Aliens, that counts, right? It's kind of action-y, sci-fi, a little bit of horror. Uh, favorite non-American movies? I like Old Boy. Um, I don't want to think of four more, sorry. Favorite sport, if any? Um, I used to do wrestling in high school. <laughs> that explains a lot, huh? Um, and I did uh, cross country. And I broke both my wrists when I was doing cross country. Running backwards. Yeah, stupid, right? I feel like a dumbass. Um, all right. Uh, can I have your autograph? Um, why would you want that? You know, I, I mean, you're better than that. I, I won't even waste a piece of paper giving it to you. Um, but if I... Uh, yeah. Have you ever thought about going into acting professionally? I can't act worth a shit. Okay, now, okay, you mentioned like American Pie type comedies. I could be in like a B-rate straight to DVD movie maybe as a small role. I could play a tree in the background. I just stand there. 
Um, you know, but that'd be cool if I if I had the opportunity, I'd definitely do it. Have you ever seen Have you seen Avengers? Of course. Um, how many water bottles do you have in front of your face right now? <laughs> um, I actually have. Uh, here's some. A couple more right here, and I have a apple juice bottle. I get dehydrated, and plus you guys can see the tiny tods protecting the water bottles back there. Um, on a scale of 1 to 10, just how gay are you? You know what? I'm not a homophobe at all. Um, and uh, But on a scale of 1 to 10, if 10 being the gayest, I'm definitely probably... I'm going to say I'm a 1. You know what I mean? Like, um, I'm not going to go into our high school shower room days. Uh, but uh, let's just say... I think um, I think everyone's about a one percent gay, don't you? I mean, just honestly, did I lose you? Okay, we'll continue. Um, what is the worst movie you've ever seen? I remember walking out of uh, Wolf Creek when I was watching that, and uh, but the worst movie I've ever seen was Brotherhood of Justice, but it's also one of the best movies I've ever seen. Uh, I just had a toothpick in my mouth, and now I don't know where it went. Has that ever happened to you? Actually, when I was about five years old, I broke a toothpick off in my teeth, and they, I had to go to the uh, dentist. What version is your Batman mask, the Dark Knight? Um, all right. Uh, do you remember the time you first saw an R-rated movie? I grew up in R-rated movies. My dad would have me watch R-rated movies on beta tape from the time I remember, like, I was four or five. I mean, I, I watched everything. Um... How many comments do you get on an average for 24 hours in all your videos? Uh, it just depends. Um, if I upload a new, vid new video and, I don't know, 60 maybe? I don't know. Uh, maybe more, maybe maybe less. Uh, can I come stay with you? Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, I guess you... No, you can't. Um, only if I can put you in a cage at night and I have to chloroform you as soon as you get here. But you're going to wake up in a safe place, I assure you. Do you ever find or make the time to take a dump? I'm not even asking if you have the time to watch Blu-ray discs. That would be almost impossible considering the amount of time you spend to make these videos. I'm not being sarcastic or anything. I'm just wondering from a YouTube watcher's point of view. Um, you know what? I spend a lot of time on YouTube. Last night I spent nine hours on the computer. Nine hours sitting here and most of it was on YouTube. Just updating things, checking things, putting videos together. I spend a lot of time on YouTube. And then I, I go to watch a movie. You know, I try to relax. I watch about 10 minutes of a movie and I fall asleep. I don't even have... I, I try to watch at least one movie a week now. And it, I can't even get that accomplished. So I spend an average of... I'm going to say an average of 4 to 5 hours a day on YouTube. I know, right? That's sad. Um, how much do you spend on movies monthly? Not not a, not much. I go to pawn shops. I buy them for a couple, couple dollars. I trade in movies to buy new movies. Um, not that much, really. Um, people think I spend a lot of money buying movies, and I don't. I barely spend anything. Actually, we are pathetic bulldogs, not poodles. Okay. Uh, can you please review the third Dark Knight trailer? I already did that. The video is on my uh, my other channel, the Flick Pick. Um, do you attend midnight movie premieres? Every time a movie's worth it, I am there at midnight. Um, so, and the thing about seeing the midnight uh, movies is I have to come home and do a review on them. And by the time I get home, it's three o'clock in the morning. I usually have to work the next day. I'm already tired. I, I mean, I hate, I just, I dread going to see the midnight movies because I know I'm going to have to go home and make a video about it. All right. It is really the cough that carries you off the cough and they carry, okay, what the hell's happening there? Um... All right, we'll continue here as the computer freezes up. All right, um, have you ever purchased the same Blu-ray twice and gone insane? No, I don't think I have. Uh, review Cabin in the Woods. I, I didn't get around to seeing it. I will watch it when it comes out on Blu-ray. Have you ever sexually assaulted Tiny Todd? No, but one time I woke up and he had his... I'm not going to... I'm not... You know what? We're not going to go into that. I, uh... Let's just say I had a restraining order against him. He talked me back in, and I let him in the house. And you know what? Um, forgive and forget is my motto. What would you do if Tiny Todd, if you caught him watching Abduction? I actually did. I caught, you know what? I watched, I was, he was watching a Taylor Lautner video late one night. I heard moaning sounds. I came into the room. I'm not going to talk about what happened, but he was covered in lotion. Um, if someone put a gun up to your head and told you that you had to choose between getting some girl 
Getting some from any girl you want or becoming Batman, which would you choose? <sighs> Batman. Because if I'm Batman, I think I can have any woman I want. And then the thing is, they, they won't recognize me because I'm wearing the mask, so they can never identify me. Um, why would I bother asking you a question if you're not going to answer it? See? See what happened? You should have asked it. Um, what is your favorite TV show, Breaking Bad? Uh, which movie do you prefer, Predator or, or Alien? I Predator. Um, I like cheesy 80s movies. What is the most uncomfortable movie you ever watched with your parents? Um, do I sound like I have a speech impediment right now? I'm f I feel really tired and my ears feel like they popped. I'm sorry, I got a stuffy nose. Okay. I watched Sleepers um, when I was very young with my stepdad. I, he was... My new stepdad, I didn't really know him too bad or too much, and I'm watching a movie about kids getting raped in prison, and I, I don't know. Um, if Batman came into your house and had to go to the bathroom, would you let him? He can go to the bathroom on my face. <laughs> Do you like video games? Yeah, I love video games. I like the classic video games, Mario Brothers. I like Sonic the Hedgehog. I like some of the new things like Call of Duty, even though Call of Duty nowadays isn't too fun to play online. Um, uh, do you think that Taylor Lautner sucks so many donkey balls that him and his family will turn into jackasses? You know what, um, I don't want to talk about Taylor Lautner anymore. You know, I just feel really uncomfortable. Uh, you had a YouTube dream. By dream, I mean sleeping. Alright, um, have you ever, have, have you seen this in England? If not, you should check it out. I haven't seen that. Um, have you seen Perfect Weapon? No, I have not. Um, would you rather be an Avenger or a character from Dragon Ball Z? <sighs> I'd rather be an Avenger. I mean, who the hell wouldn't want to be? I think... <sighs> I don't know. It's tough to pick which Avenger you would be. I mean, honestly, think about the ups and downs of each one of those. <sighs> I think Thor would be a fun one. I, but then again, I think Captain America would be the most normal. Have you ever farted while getting a BJ? And that has two thumbs up. Um, no, I don't. No, I haven't. Um, if you were stuck at a desert island with some random guy and there was no hope for ever being saved, would you break down and give him or receive a handy from him? Plus, would you take him out if needed to have his sweet flesh to survive? Um, do I sound like I don't know how to read? Um, it's just the way these are typed. Um, yeah, man. Um, it depends how long I was on the desert island and uh, how feminine he was. Uh, what's your favorite music group? Uh, I like I like um, soundtracks for movies like The Dark Knight. Um, I like uh, I like Metallica. I like uh, stuff like that. Uh, do you like Kevin Smith's movies? Um, I like Clerks, Clerks Two, Zack and Mary, and uh, everything else is just yeah. Do you have a job? Yes, I have a job. If you could bum any actor, who would it be and why? If you could bum... Is that British wit for have sex? Bum any actor? Um, well, we'll go with actress. How's that? I don't know. Jessica Biel? I don't know why. Um, what's your favorite video game and snacks to have with a movie? I love gummy bears with a, with a, a movie. Uh, do you... Do you see what happens when you fuck with a? Oh, do you see what happens when you fuck a stranger in the ass? Yes, I do, sir. Uh, have you checked out Cabin in the Woods? No, I haven't. Um, do you have a favorite T-shirt? Um, right now, I'm wearing uh, what the hell is this? Oh, Big League Chew. But uh, my Batman T-shirts really make me feel like a big man, so I like wearing those. And uh, am I still recording? I don't even know if this thing's recording anymore. It doesn't matter. I'll just sit here and talk to myself if it's not. How many Blu-rays do you have? Um, I don't know, man. I really don't know. Um, what was your high school life like? It was okay. I was kind of like a slacker. I did everything at the last second. I cheated. I copied. I actually paid um, one kid uh, to copy off his um, uh, final paper one time. Um, I came to class late. I, I was just... Lazy piece of shit in high school. Um, top ten directors, not because... Uh, okay, top ten directors, um, James Cameron, Steven Spielberg, Christopher Nolan. Uh, you know, um, 
Zemeckis. Not a lot of people talk about Zemeckis nowadays, but he, he made some really good movies. Um, I don't want to think anymore. Um, okay, what is the best Blu-ray you own? Uh, the Dark Knight, maybe. Um, how many movies do you have? I've answered that. Have you ever farted in front of a girlfriend? Um, yeah, oh yeah. More than that, trust me. Uh, what kind of TV do you have? Um, I own a LG Plasma 50-inch 1080p. I don't know the model number, um, but it, I like Plasma TVs, and I need to make a video about um, Plasma versus LCD one of these days. Do you live in, let's see, in regards to not safe topic of recording while driving, have you ever been pulled over by the police or had any close calls while uh, taping. No, I haven't. I mean, I'm not going to drive up beside a, a cop. Hey, look at me. Hey, guys, it's John here with the flick. You know, I am I put it down or else I act like I put my seatbelt on for two seconds. Uh, no, but uh, I have been pulled over quite a few times, but not while I was uh, recording. How long do you think Tiny Todd would, would survive in the zombie apocalypse? Well, Tiny Todd's already dead inside. Plus, he has no flesh to eat, so he's safe. Um, do you enjoy driving around while recording videos? You guys see him every week. What do you think? Um, favorite mainstream Hollywood actor? I like Christian Bale as of right now. Tom Hardy also. Um, what is your secret fetish? Oh, man. Uh, let's just... You know what? I'm not even going to talk. It involves latex gloves. How's that? Guilty pleasure band. Guilty pleasure band. Hmm. Lady Gaga. I'm sorry. But not really a band. Uh, most genuinely frightened you have ever been by a movie. Nightmare on Elm Street. When I watched that when I was little, I watched it down in our, our basement, and it was just... It, it scarred me emotionally. In an arm wrestling match, who would win? You or Chuck Norris? I would break that old man's fucking hip. And then he would round cat, he would roundhouse kick me in the face. I'd fall over, but then I'd get up, and then... Um, Chuck Norris nowadays is kind of getting brittle. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Back in the day, he would have kicked my ass. Uh, you have five movies to watch the rest of your life. Um, just, give, just give me the Dark Knight. Give me the Dark Knight and over the top. Uh, who would you? What would you do for a Klein Dyke bar? Um, I don't know. I don't really. I like um, I like drumsticks a little bit better. Um, where do you work? Um, I work a few different jobs. One of them includes driving a lot. And other ones with my stepfather, where I uh, I deliver things, um, but I don't do that one so much anymore. If you captured and given the choice of getting either both your hands or penis cut off, what would it be? You know, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. A man does everything in life because of his penis. Everything that you do is because of that. Everything that you, you everything that drives you is because of that. I don't need hands. I need a penis. Do you understand? Um, what is your job? I kind of gave you guys. I, I told you a little bit about that already. Why am I viewer? I don't know. John, out of curiosity, exactly how many Blu-rays... I already answered that. What kind of... I already answered that. Don't put the questions on the video. It's the other one. Yeah, thank you. I'm actually answering the questions on the video where I told people not to put them, but I still got 30-something pages. But, you know, I'm not going to complain. You know, screw it. Who am I to complain? Just some asshole on the Internet? It doesn't matter. I'll answer them. Hi, mate. Just interested to know if you would rather fight one 12-foot-tall monkey or 12 one-foot-tall monkeys. Hmm. It's a thinker. I'm going to go with the, um... Those little short bastards are going to bite my ankles, and I don't... I think I could handle a 12-foot-tall monkey. No, I... Ooh, I'd, I'd fight the tall, the short ones. I'd stomp them. But I'd have to be wearing a, a pair of steel-toed work boots. Okay, let's continue. Are you with Machinima now? Yes, I joined Machinima last month. Um, here's a question. You have been captured by a tribe of ancient, ancients, ancients, sorry for the speech impediment, uh, tell you that you are going to be sacrificed as a gift to the gods of the underworld, but you will not be alone. You're allowed to pick two people to be sacrificed with you. You also have to choose how. One person that will... I'm going to choose, like, Carrot Top, and I'm going to choose um, Tom Hanks. And I want Tom Hanks, I want his. I want him to be decapitated, and for Carrot Top, I want him, um, I want him to be burned alive. Um, I like Tom Hanks, though, but I just want somebody there who can comfort me, and that's what he does. Uh, do you view films as an art form? Of course. Um, do you read? 
I haven't read a book in years, but actually that's a lie. I I read a few books um, last year. Uh, don't ask me what they were called, but I like reading um, books based on true events um, more than anything. One other question. More and more movies these days are showing trailers. They show parts of the movie. When you go to see the movie... Um, so basically you're saying trailers are showing too much. I agree. Um, and it's ruining everything. But people nowadays, just they can't, they can't just be surpri surprised. They need to see half the movie... To get them to go see the rest of the movie. And you know, it's it's sad. Like, there's a kid I know that um, every time he gets in his car to even go anywhere, he checks his Facebook. It's like, you're not important, Jesus Christ. You don't need to always... What am I talking about? I'm going off into some rant about socialism and uh, the, the new generation. I'm sorry. Uh, I was wondering what your view on region codes are. I don't... As long as they work in America, I don't, I don't care. Um... But I think it's stupid that they do the region codes. Just make it universal. Just make it work everywhere. everywhere. Love your channel, dude. Awesome videos. What are your top five directors, actors? Uh, top five actors, I, you know, Christian Bale, um, Tom Hardy, Patrick Swayze, I know, um, Tom Hanks. Uh, I don't know. Oh, I like Leonardo DiCaprio, too. Uh, actresses, um... I'd have to think about that for too long, and I don't feel like editing the video. Uh, do you have any siblings? Yeah, I have uh, three. Or I have three. Wait, I'm sorry. I have four sisters and two brothers. Um, if you were a girl for a day, what would you do? Oh man, myself. Um, see, that's an asshole. I'm a pervert. Oh well. Um, my favorite movies change daily because of personal experience, mood. Um, how do you decide what your favorite movies are? Just if they hit that emotional chord inside of me and really... they gotta get, There's got to be that one scene that gives me goosebumps because it was just so damn heartwarming or badass. Uh, what is your favorite color? It starts with a K. Cl Chlamydia yellow. Chlamydia starts with a C. Yeah. Damn it, you got me. Um, if you could be Predator for one day, what would you do? I'd go back and kick Arnold's ass. Um, how sad are you going to be when the next movie format is released? Um, yeah. The next format's going to be direct download. It's not going to be another optical disc. You know what I mean? There's no reason for it. People can't even fathom 1080p now. You know what I mean? People don't. Uh, the mass majority of people don't see it worth the upgrade over DVD. So if they don't see that, they're not going to go any higher in resolution. There's just no point to it. Um, even though they could, but they're not going to. And they're not even using 1080p to its full capacity. If you see half the Blu-rays that come out on Blu-ray, they're not really using it to the full capacity it's capable of. So the next thing is going to be digital downloads, which is going to actually look like shit because you're going to have a lot of compression. Um... um Okay. What is your favorite science fiction movie? Um, I like Alien, um, but if you don't want to go with that, I don't want to think about another one. Is the new Star Trek considered real science fiction? I know it's it's science fiction, but it's action. I don't know why. In recent years, that's one of my favorite. I don't know why. Um, what are your three favorite movies of the year so far? Uh, 2012, uh, The Avengers... Um, I don't remember what else came out this year. I like the Avengers. How's that? Uh, what are your thoughts on My Little Pony? Um, I never watched it. Never was into My Little Pony. Um, my question is, who's your favorite director? And have you ever seen the 1975 movie Barry Lyndon directed by Stanley Kubrick? No, I have not. Um, hey, John, here's my question to you. If you could be an event... I already answered that. I already answered this. Um... Have you ever seen the movie Judgment Night with Emilio Estevez? Hell yes, I have. That is badass. Um, I like when they all hide out in that one part and they, they all have like a pipe and an old stick. Um, what are your thoughts on the 2002 horror film Ghost Ship? Uh, very forgettable. Um, what are your favorite bands? Already answered that. Uh, name three things about Justin Timberlake and the social network. Go. Cocky, arrogant, curly blonde hair. Um... How big of a pain in the ass is it to answer all these questions? It honestly, I slightly enjoy it, but um, it gets, uh, it's tiring. 
I'm tired and uh, I want to lay down and go to sleep. But I, for some reason, I feel like I'm, I'm driven to do this. I want to chew some bubble gum too. I don't know why. Are you getting tired of all all the? Are you getting tired of answering all these questions by this point in this list? A little bit. But I'm going to continue. Got to strive through. Why did we fall, Bruce? So we can get back up again. Um, that was my my um, my British impression. I can't. Do you guys hear my speech? And yeah, this is a that that means I'm tired. What Marvel and DC crossover would you like to see? Batman, Superman, um, Star Wars, or Lord of the Rings? Star Wars all day. And what game do you like? Um, oh, what game would you like to be made into a film? I would like to see a really good Mario Brothers film. Yeah, yeah, we got one of those many years ago, but it sucked ass. What actress would you like to? Uh, fuck to death. Um, hmm. Amber Heard. Uh, do you believe in God? Um, I believe in doing what's right. I believe in living life good. Um, but, uh, that'd be a long topic. That'd be a long subject to answer. What is your dream job? I like to make YouTube videos all day long. Are you going to see the Dark, not dark Shadows in cinema? No, I'm not. Uh, if you could star in any movie, what movie would it be? What character and why? I'd like to play a. Um, I'd like to p play um, uh, in Gilbert Grape, like a new remade version of that. I'd like to play Arnie. I think I could do a good Arnie. Um, are there any sports that you like? And if so, what teams do you support? I support the Cincinnati Bengals NFL. All right. Thanks for the Q and A. Have any superpower? What would it be and why? Uh, maybe to fly. Uh, favorite film leading up to the Avengers? I'm gonna go with Iron Man, favorite superhero, Batman, Marvel, or DC. Marvel movies on a whole have made more consistent, better movies, but DC has Batman, The Dark Knight Rises, enough said. Iron Man 3 or Thor 2? Mm. Thor 2, I think there's more to offer there. Iron, Iron Man 3... I don't know. I'm kind of getting a little... I'm kind of bored with it. Um, superhero film you would want to see a sequel to. <sighs> Just give me another Batman movie. That's all I need. What is your favorite Michael Mann movie? Heat. Um, what is your favorite chick flick? I, uh, chick flick. Pretty Woman. I forgot about this in the last comment. What do you think is the most underrated movie performance and most overrated? Most underrated movie performance wow uh, i think leonardo dicaprio has he never gets the awards he deserves um so i would say um mm, like catch me if you can or the aviator and most overrated that would be um what's her name sandra bullock in the blind side come on seriously uh who's your favorite fictional i'm sorry better leave my bow alone you know, it's it's like okay. Uh, who's your favorite fictional serial killer? Um, fictional serial killer. I'll name a few serial killers. I like John Wayne Gacy, Ted Bundy, but let's go with uh, Christian Bale in American Psycho for um, for the uh, realm of nonfiction. Non wait, nonfiction is reality, and fiction is reality. Yeah. So okay. Um, if you could make a movie, which what would it be? I would love to see like another movie, kind of like Point Break. Um, I just like bank robbery movies with badass action. If you could be, if if you could ever be in a movie, which genre would, would it be? Action comedy. I think that would work. Do you think there is a future? Oh, I'm sorry. Do you ever think the future is going to be like the movies or no? No. Um, well, there's going to be a lot of... Given another 20 years, there's going to be a lot of suffering and depression. Because uh, we're going to run out of food. Just wait. Uh, what do you prefer? What do you prefer? Dead at the age of 70, but as a rich man. Dead at the age of 110, but as a poor man or average man. Dead at the age of 45, but you will never be forget forgotten by the world. Um, dead at 70 as a rich man sounds good. Past 70, you know, I'm just getting, it's too old. You know, I, I can't even do what I want to do. Um, uh, you have to watch one last movie you have seen, but for the rest of your life. Which movie would I watch for the rest of my life? Oh, uh, I would watch, 
That's too hard of a question. Why would you do that to me? I don't know. The Dark Knight Rises, uh, Terminator 2, Point Break. Uh, what is your job other than YouTube? I kind of answered that already. What well, worst movie uh, or one of the worst movies ever? I already answered that. Um, okay, let's keep scrolling down here. Woman over 60 years old, you're attracted to. Uh, Raquel Welch, is she over 60? Oh, well. Um, GFK, UFOs, 9-11, what do you think of women with tattoos? I don't mind women with tattoos, it just depends. Um, speaking of UFOs, um, yeah, there's something out there. There's something out there. GFK uh, was an inside job. Uh, what is your favorite Nicolas Cage performance? Uh, Bad Lieutenant. Okay, so um, we'll just make this the first part. We'll end it right there. My brain is actually melting out of my ear right now. And Tiny Todd's giving me the evil eye. Um, anyway, um, part two will be up in a few days. Um, and I still have tons of questions left. Hundreds and hundreds of questions. This is Blink. I'm on it.